SLC has totally revamped their style with this new album. I am not sure if it is for the better or worse because they totally sound like 4 Minute with their title track. Cube should get their minds together and find other sounds or style for SLC. Liar should have been their title track. It has a different sound but it still has that faint sussy sound. This song is so different from their title track and other girl groups song. It's such a waste. It is slow and can have a dark music video. Their title track, Hobgoblin is also a great song but this is 4 minute all over it. Also, the rapper's voice sounds so much like Hannah, in a bad way. However, I really like Sung Hee's part in this song. Pa totally saved it. Another track that is very much like Sulsi's debut style is the third song, Mistake. This also could have been their title track but Cube thought otherwise. It is another slow song but is not boring. Meow Meow is another great track from the album. The beat is really modern and the arrangement is not messy at all. I love how the song is laid most of the time but has some amazing moments that will hype up the listener. The girls of Sissy take down the excitement as the next song is a slow one. I mean is the only song that has a heavy R&B influence from the album. Even the rap is slower than in other songs. Tears Bottle is a straight up ballad. However, it is not like any other K-pop ballads as it has a grandiose feel to it. Like a Disney song that the princess would sing during her sad moments and it would cheer her up after. I am in love with the melody of the song. After listening to the whole album, Sissy deserves so much better. Their B-side tracks are gems. I am giving this album 4.3 out of 5. Listen to the album yourself and hear the difference. Disclaimer, views and opinions expressed in this article are those of the author and not necessarily those of K-pop stars. Copyright Copyright 2017 K-pop stars.com All rights reserved. <laughs>